Hello my loves, it is me Tiggy and I am back with another video. So today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to mod GB Insta. The reason why I'm not messing around with the regular Instagram is because GB Insta is completely customizable. After you finish modding everything, um, as far as the icons, you can go back into the settings and change all the colors. So I do like to use that as well as with GB Insta. If you see a funny video, someone post it and you wanted to repost, you don't need to get those repost apps. With GB Insta, you can actually save the um, video straight to your phone and then you can repost it and, you know, just tag the person in it for credit. So that is why I like GB Insta better. So let me show you what I've done so far. As you can see, my search and then like the little like uh, main page contact looking icon is not themed i didn't finish theming those because i wanted to come to you guys with a video where i finished that up so first things first is as you can see you will need all together five images so i'm gonna go ahead and look for two more images i'm gonna just show you guys how i go ahead and get those done so all i do is go to google and i'm gonna look for my melody transparent click on images so now I'm gonna just look for some really cute images of my melody which this is adorable So I got that one, and let's look at this one, and we'll use this one. And just in case you guys are wondering, this theme here is super duper freaking cute. This is called, I forget what it's called, that's so sad, but we're going to figure it out. This is called My Melody Larm by, this is by Cheryl. So I do know who it's by, but I just forgot the name. Sorry, Cheryl. Um, um, but, or Sherry. But <laughs> this is, um, the cutest freaking theme, y'all. Like, it's freaking adorable. Like, it's adorable. It's adorable. I cannot get over how cute it is. But it's, it's, I love it. It's so cute. And the settings are even themed. The only thing that sucks is when you're not an official. And just keep this in mind, guys. Whenever you purchase from people, I'll definitely um, make sure to, when I post my little video on, or my little um, shot onto Instagram and tell you guys that this vi video is available, I'll make sure to tag Sherry in it so you guys know. Um, but just keep in mind with anybody who is not an official Samsung Themer developer like through samsung it is a program you have to apply for you have to submit a portfolio and all that good stuff um if you're not an official person from them and you don't have the up-to-date samsung theme maker like on the computer um the chat bubbles will not work for us so unless the person's old because the software is older software because you can go on you can go on Google and find the theme editor, but that's an older uh, uh, software. So you need an older device that has older software on it to be able to get those bubbles to show. If you have a newer device that's on the newest software, those chat bubbles won't show. So it's not really the, the person who's making them fall at all, guys. Um, Samsung just is booty and they should like allow people to create themes like you guys could find so many gifted people but they make things very difficult um but i just kind of want to put that tidbit out there but anywho this theme is by sherry you guys definitely should go check her out she makes such cute work um and i would definitely make sure to leave her name down below for you guys and then when i post on instagram that this video is live i'll make sure to tag her so you guys know to go ahead and check her out so that's why i'm making my gb insta my melody to match my samsung theme but anywho i got the two pictures that i wanted so what we're gonna do is go into apk editor 
hit select APK from app. You can hit the first one, but this is easier for me. So like, why would I make things more difficult? So that's why I hit this one. Everyone does things a little different. And we're going to look for GB Insta and hit simple edit. And we're going to do the same thing as I did before, guys. And you're going to hit images and you're going to search. Now, these images should be near the top. Not all the way at the top, but they're they're closer to the top. And they'll be a little easier for me to find only because um, I edited some already. And I believe if I'm correct, they're all like back to back. So there, you do got to search a little bit, guys. Okay. So here's this. So as you can see, this, these are both search outline and search filled. So I'm going to go ahead and click. And we're going to look for those images that I just saved, which here is one, which I'm going to use this one first since it was just there. Uh, uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and use this one as well. And then here goes the user part. Okay. So we're going to click on this. And look for that other one that I got. Which I can't find. Maybe I didn't save it. But it's okay. So <laughs> what I'm going to do instead is look for. See if I'm able to find one. This is cute. So I'm going to save this one. Go back. And then I know what that looks like. So that will be easier for me to find any who. So we'll do that. So then when we're done, and this is kind of a trial and error, guys. I will let you guys know that with some um, of the apps um, that are modded already, like GB Insta or like a Spotify app, it can be easy to find which icons you want to change. But sometimes it is like a little difficult, okay? So um, just keep that in mind, guys. <laughs> Here goes the icon. So what I'm going to do is what we're going to do is search for Instagram. We'll see if they have it. Yeah, they do. Haha. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and literally see if it'll work because I don't know if it'll work. And we're going to change that Instagram logo. Um, we'll try this one. So I'm going to save. Wish me luck, guys. So then I'm going to look for that one. <clears throat> and this one and I think those are the only two icon ones but I'm going to quickly scroll through here you can change the heart as well um, but I feel like that's kind of pointless because with GB Insta you can change the color of that so you don't have to change the icon and deal with all that hassle because if you go into the settings you can just change the color And then it'll be a, so much easier. Yeah, that's the only other icons. Yeah, those are the only other icons. Um, so what's really nice as well, as you guys, when, once you're done this whole process, um, now that you have changed those icons, it's going to be so much easier for you to go ahead and get to those icons and literally just switch them out for whatever you want. But when you're done with changing your icons, you're going to hit save.
It's doing its thing. It's taking forever. <laughs> then you're going to hit remove because you need to remove the old one. If you forget this part, then it's definitely not going to work for you. Once it says it's uninstalled, you're going to hit install. Just please, 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 guys, keep that in mind. Um, also, keep in mind that every time you switch these out, when you remove and then reinstall, you most likely will have to um, re-sign into everything. But as you guys can see, my GB Insta at the top, the icon is now that pink Instagram icon. So we know that that worked. So we're going to open and... I'm going to sign in and boom, there goes these. <clears throat> now I see what I did. I didn't fill, I didn't put an icon for when it's just an outline of the contact. Okay. So I can go ahead and fix that. Also, what I'm going to look at is yes sweet so there goes my gb instant as you guys can see that icon has also changed but what i'm going to do is when you run into problems like this guys all you have to do is go back into your apk editor hit select apk from app Ooh, i scroll too fast y'all go to your gb insta simple edit images and scroll down now i told you guys it's going to be much easier for you to find things because um you've already changed so much okay so i'm going to scroll some more so here goes the instagram user outline so i have to change that save let it do its thing. Taking forever, isn't it? Remove. And then install. Like I said, guys, do not forget about removing then installing because it will not work for you so um that's usually the part that people forget and then they like a little upset about things and there we go so now i fixed it so now i have icons for everything and then of course um i would have to go back and recolor my gb insta that is why um i did color some things um it was mostly just like the top bar where it's a style squad up here um but now i get to go in and just basically um color everything so i would suggest if you're going to do this do not color your gb insta go ahead and change all the icons first at the bottom then go back and you know color your gb insta because it's gonna be very frustrating if you take all that time to color everything uh -huh. just to have to go back and change it so i hope this video was helpful guys i hope you didn't mind my little commentary um but I love you guys. Thank you for being so supportive and I hope you all have a blast.